Hello, ladies and gentlemen, it's Mike here at Game From Scratch, and today we are looking at the just launched in preview Unreal Academy. Now, what is this? Well, it is a learning portal. It is a place for Unreal to put all of their uh, getting started materials and a bit of a persistence element to it. So what it does is it tracks where you are currently in the course. So when you go back later on, you can jump right back into the course at that point in time. Now, this is actually very early on. There's not a whole lot here, but if you're interested in checking it out, you can go to preview academy academy.unrealengine.com and you'll log in with your Unreal Engine credentials and it will bring you here. Now, I will of course toss this link down below, but you will notice when you first come to the homepage, there are currently only three courses shown. Now, this is a little bit misleading because there is more here, but for some reason, they're only highlighting those three courses. Those three courses are introducing Unreal Engine, uh, touring the Unreal Engine learning portal, which is ironically a uh, tutorial about using this website, uh, and then your first hour with Unreal Engine. And in any one of these courses, you will see it tracks your uh, how far you've made it through. So you see here, I have done 6% of this course. Now the courses themselves are entirely video based right now. And you'll see this is the one course, uh, you can see my tracking. So when I come back into it, it will update as I go through it and it will bring me back to wherever I was last. And that's kind of the biggest thing about this new portal. Now you'll see here, uh, the courses again are broken down in videos. It shows you the ones that I have completed along the way there could be quizzes like you could see here and here. Um, and that is kind of it in a nutshell. Now, this is what you get if you go to home. But if you go to course library, you'll see there are actually more courses here than are listed. Now, oddly enough, there is nothing there specific for game development as of yet. But there are a number of courses that haven't been migrated here yet, as we will see in just a second. So the courses that exist right now at the Academy are uh, Advanced Techniques for Architects, Advanced Techniques for Automotive and Aerospace, an in-depth look at real-time um, rendering, uh, best practice for creating and using plugins, blueprints for enterprise, blueprint, blueprints, essential concepts, building better pipelines, um, comprehending projects and file structures, creating an architectural exterior real-time project, creating an architectural interior real-time project, creating PBR materials, creating virtual reality walkthroughs, uh, getting to know materials for design visualization, getting to know UW, UVW mapping for architectural visualization, high-end product lighting and rendering, and interactive material swaps using blueprints. Now, as you see, there is a lot of ArchViz courses there and pretty much nothing about game development yet. Although some of these more generalized things like creating PBR materials and stuff about blueprints or pipelines, that's useful um, regardless to what actual industry you are in. Now, the entire time you're watching this, you might be thinking to yourself, hmm, this is sounding kind of familiar. And if you're used to game from scratch um, and you've been watching for a while, now maybe just last week, you saw the video I put up about Unity Learn. Yes, Unity literally just launched an online learning portal that tracks your current progress and automatically jumps back to where you were and is a place where they're consolidating together all of their courseware together in a single place uh, last week. So uh, this isn't uh, this is not a tit for tat thing. Obviously, this was under development all along, but it's kind of funny that they both launched pretty much identical um, things at the exact same time. There is definitely probably some reaction going on here. They may have pushed out the preview a little bit earlier, uh, but as you'll see in just a second, a lot of this content was already existing. Coincidentally, if you are a Unity developer, Unity offers a probably more mature version of this. Plus, they also have text tutorials. So if you're interested in learning more about that. I will toss this video link down below as well. But anyways, back to Unreal Engine. Now, the reason why I say Unreal Engine aren't copycatting is because the reality is right now you can go to academy.unrealengine.com. Now, keep in mind, the new version is Preview Academy, but academy.unrealengine.com is their home for courseware. So really, this is the same material or like a lot of it you're going to see. This is the exact same. So high-end product lighting and rendering exterior high-end product lighting and rendering exterior. So we're talking the same uh, content available. The, the big difference here is the new one is going to have that persistence and, and the achievements and so on and so forth. So this is the new home for things. Now, if you go to the Academy site, you will notice there are 14 classes that are game development related. Um, 
and you'll come in here. Some of these are actually, again, courses we saw elsewhere, but Blueprint Essential Concepts, Interactive Material Swaps, Real-Time Rendering, uh, Creating Plugins in Unreal Engine 4, Building Better Pipelines in Unreal Engine 4, Making the Switch from Unity to Unreal Engine 4, Post-Processing Essentials, Lighting Essential Concepts, Real-Time Rendering Fundamentals, Introduction to Global Illumination in Unreal Engine 4, Materials Production Workflow, UE4 Basics, Material Essential Concepts, um, and then Projects, Files, and Structures. Now, keep in mind, each one of these courses is also composed of multiple videos. So here you go. It's the same sort of concept. Uh, where is my... Oh, I guess you got to go to start class to go through it. Uh, this, All of this material is, I imagine, going to be migrated over to the new form factor for the Academy. And it's just going to make it a bit more of a user experience, I guess. Uh, but even if not, the same material you're looking for is all available here. So if you do want to uh, check that out or you're interested in learning Unreal Engine, be sure to check out academy.unrealengine.com and then preview-academy.unreal.engine.com for the updated version. Now I'm curious, is, is this kind of stuff important to you? Mostly like that, that um, taking it in small bites, the persistence of where did I leave off, or do you care or are you motivated by achievements? Be interested in knowing what you think down below. I'll also be interested if you've checked out um, Unity Learn and this, the Academy, the Unreal Engine Academy, which one impresses you more? And I know a lot of people are pretty stoked about the text-based versions of the tutorials, and I have to agree with that. I like to see that. So I would love to see um, Unreal Engine follow suit on that one. Uh, but right now, I think it's mostly all about consolidating their materials together. Uh, so yeah, if you're interested in checking it out, uh, there the, the links will be, of course, down below. And that's it for now. I will talk to you all later. Goodbye.